One young woman at UNL is paving her way to accomplishing her goals in a male-dominated field. My name is Mary Foster. I'm originally from the Omaha area, and I'm a junior here at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln. I am currently studying finance with a minor in entrepreneurship, and I'm hoping to add a minor in econ pretty soon. Mary is getting involved in gaining the real-life experience she is looking for before stepping out into the real world. I'm involved in the Big Red Investment Club, and that is a pretty general club that just uh, teaches people about the finance industry, and they bring in really cool guest speakers and do networking events. But within that club, there's the club stock pitch, um, and that's really what I'm a part of. And we work with a real financial portfolio, and we write equity reports um, in teams that we spend the whole semester researching. Foster shows that you don't have to be a mathlete to be able to work and help people financially. This is kind of funny, but I'm not that great at math, but for some reason, if you put a dollar sign in front of it, like in front of an equation, I'm like super into it. I think I just like working with real numbers or like things that have a real consequence per se. Um, but watching financial advisors help everyday people get their life on track and help save for their retirement or maybe for their kids' college funds really inspired me to study that. She knew going into these clubs that she would be one out of the handful of girls in Big Red Investment and the only girl in Stock Pitch, but that didn't stop her. So the current president of the Big Red Investment Club, she is actually a girl. She's one of the few, um, and she's really inspiring. I actually am friends with her younger sister, and she was telling me about a year ago that they were really desperate looking for girls to join this club. And so I kind of took that leap of faith. I went out on a limb and I joined it. And I'm really glad I did because I've learned so much about the industry and I really like the work that we do. It can be really intimidating, especially since some of these men are really into finance and I'm still kind of new to the game. I don't quite know as much, um, but so far there have been a few that have really helped me out and have made me feel welcomed in the club. Foster felt behind at first, but she decided to take this challenge head on. I really worked hard on my own, like on my own time. I wanted to feel more confident in my own knowledge, so I went out of my way to learn as much as I could, and that really helped. And then it was just a matter of pushing myself to show up every single time. Sometimes I'd get like anxiety. I'm like, oh, I won't go today, but no, like I have to go. Um, and then just my love for the work we do was definitely super motivating. Even though she just started, she is proud of the little accomplishments she has made so far. The club really tries to motivate people to do their own investment with their own money on their own time, which can be really scary because if you lose that money, like that is your money that you lost. Um, but recently I did start investing and I haven't made any money so far, but I'm really proud of myself for just taking that leap. For any woman who is pursuing a dream in a male-dominated field, Foster has a piece of advice. To never let anyone tell you you can't do something. Um, so often we doubt ourselves and other people doubt us, but you really don't know unless you try. Um, and that can be really difficult, it can be scary, you know, but really just try to put yourself out there. You can absolutely do anything if you put your mind to it.